We're not young, Margaret. Well, we're not old. Don't start what you can't finish. George Blacklist is an everyman. He's a small town sheriff slash cattle rancher, and he's in love with his wife. Their relationship has had all the ups and downs that any other marriage has had. They've been married for 30 plus years, and Margaret found herself in the business of raking horses to be rideable, and that was their life. It's a very humble house that they live in, and they're still supportive of each other. They're still in love. This woman I married but can't figure. Doesn't believe there's any world but this one. But still believes a horse has got a soul somehow. That's the gal for me. George and Margaret are new grandparents when their son has been killed. And their daughter-in-law remarries this new young man, Donnie Weeboy. And because of his true nature, we fear for the safety of our grandchild. Hello? You the girl's mother? No. Lorna was married to my son. The little boy's my grandson. Well, you missed him. Gone now. They mentioned when they'd be back? Not no time soon, be my guess. Took all they had. What starts off is just want to make sure he's safe. The reality is she's going to want the child back. I won't be coming back here without him. The way it unfolds, this story just comes out like yarn. We're trying to locate a Donnie wee boy. Where in the hell are we? You let it be known you're looking for a wee boy. I'll find you. It's pretty shocking what they find. It goes into this quite dark, surreal place with the wee boy family. Come with us. He'd kill me, him and his mother. The wee boys are like Dobermans on a chain with their mother. We came to see our grandson. My boy doesn't have to answer to you. And we don't have to answer to you. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Margaret is not wrong about anything that she wants to do, but this situation is no longer in their hands. He hit Lorna. Like. People haven't seen a movie like this in a while. It stands the test of time. It's a cautionary tale about forcing your will at the loss of something that you could not have calculated. It's written so beautifully and so strong and shocking. There's something a little bit scary about Let Him Go. You're with me on this, right? Right behind you.